Hey guys, so it's the end of June and time for my June favorites. Um, I feel like June went by wicked fast, I don't know why. I just feel like it went by really, really fast, but I don't know. I'm excited for it to be July and then August and it will be my birthday, so I'm happy about that. Okay, anyway, so let's get started. Um, the first thing I have is my MAC gel liner in Impeccably Rich. I just really like this. Um, it's really fun for the summer because it's like a little gel liner and it's so pretty and pigmented and sparkly and I don't know, I just really like it. And it's like gold like the sun, I guess you would say. The next things are two things that I got from um, Hot Look, which is probably should be my June favorites too because that is literally my obsession. Every single time I go on Hot Look, I can't resist buying something. Like today I bought um, Jessica Simpson extensions because those extensions, if you get them at like Ulta, they're like 100 but I got them today for $30. So I freaked out and I was really happy. But anyways, moving on. So I got two things from Rockin' Republic. I've never tried this brand before, and since it was on sale, I was like, why not try it? And I really like it. Like, look how huge this is. When I got this, I was like, because it's supposed to be an eyeshadow. But then again, you open it. Isn't this like the coolest packaging ever? And then you can take this out of here if you want. And then it looks like this. It's like a nice white, whitish, grayish color. I don't know. I don't really have any color that's like that, so I really wanted it, and I really like it. Um, I'm wearing it kind of today in my inner corners, if you can tell. And this is in the color Siggy. Yeah. <laughs> and then the other thing that I got that I love, that I've been loving, is this Rock and Republic lip gloss. And it's an imposter. And I just love nude lip glosses so much. So, I don't know. I really like this one. I don't know. Oh, another nude lip gloss that I've been loving randomly in June is my Lady Gaga one. Um, I like this lip gloss, but I stopped using it for a while because I was liking a different um, MAC lip gloss, the Flower Power one or whatever it was called. Yeah, I was liking that one a lot, and I was liking Laura Abundance, I think it's called. And then I just have been neglecting this one, and then I wore it like a few nights ago, and I've been wearing it like a lot more, and I realized that I really like this, and I was like, why have I not been wearing this? So this is back in the game. The next thing I've been loving, which I feel like I've talked about in like every video in June, <laughs> is my Laura Geller blush. I just love it. It works so good and it came in my birch box once again, which I will mention again. Um, but it's such a good color and seriously it works on everyone's skin tones. I'm wearing it right now if you can tell, but I don't know. I just love it. And another blush that I randomly have been liking too is the Benetint. Um, at first I wasn't really liking it that much because I thought it was kind of weird. I thought it didn't really show up. But then I realized that you need to use more than one, like, dot. You have to use, like, a few and then rub it in. So, yeah, I've been liking this, too. It's getting up there. But still, Laura Geller is my favorite. <laughs> Next is, um, the Ink for Eyes by Urban Decay that I got. Um, I'm, like, obsessed with this, too. Because it's, like, very glittery and I just love glitter. And I always like to put it like right here in my inner corners and then I put it like under too and it has like glitter. But the only thing that I don't like about it is that it kind of gets all over my face. Whenever I wear it, like last night, me and my friends were going out and I wore it. And then I had glitter on my face and I was like, are you kidding me? So, like if you're going to use this, I suggest doing um, your foundation and stuff after. So that way you can get the glitter off your face because this leaves glitter like everywhere. <laughs> but it's really cute. So it's worth it. My last makeup related product is the CoverGirl Aqua Smoothers. I know I've mentioned this a lot too, but I just really like it. <laughs> um, I haven't been wearing like any foundation or like really any face makeup this summer. I've just been using this and then um, just put blush on. Because like this is literally all you need. Because I feel like in the summertime, everyone's skin looks like more clear and stuff because you're tan. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I feel like my face gets like much clearer in the summer. And then I'd, I'd just rather use um, just a tinted moisturizer. And it has SPF on it too, so I don't know. It's amazing. Moving on to hair products. I don't know if I've mentioned this in a video, but Garnier Fructis 3-Minute Undo. Yes, I love this. I think I mentioned it in my favorites video for um, my collab channel. So maybe some of you guys haven't heard about this, but I am in love with this. Um... It has all of avocado and shea, 
and it has apricot seeds in it so when you're like washing it in your hair you can feel like the seeds and I don't know I just feel like the seeds do something extra but they probably don't but I don't know my opinion I feel like they do but this stuff works so good um I used to not really like Garnier but lately I've been liking it a lot because <laughs> I've been using my Garnier conditioner and then I've been using this too and this just really helps because like the other day for example I sprayed my hair with like a lot of hairspray because when I was going to the Taylor Swift concert I just sprayed my hair with like a lot of hairspray because I didn't want it to like fall or anything and the next day I was like kind of cool my hair and I was like oh my god it's so damaged now because all that hairspray and um then I used that and it felt much better and it's like leaves my hair really shiny too so I don't know I really like that speaking of hairspray um my favorite hairspray right now is Aussie Sun Touched Shine and I don't know if you can still get this. This is kind of bad because I don't really use hairspray a lot, but I got this hairspray last summer and I usually don't really use hairspray that much, but I've been kind of using it lately because I want my hair to stay and I realize that if I curl my hair and I don't put hairspray in it, then it falls intensely. So anyways, I've been loving this and this leaves your hair like not too like crunchy because I really hate my hair is like crunchy it just leaves it like good and I feel like it does add a shine and it says sun touch shine so those are all my beauty related favorites this month I guess yeah beauty and hair and all that stuff related stuff and um my favorite show of June has been okay first is the killing I didn't know this show existed and then I was like on iTunes and I saw that it was like the number one show of the week or whatever so and I was like, what is this show? I'm going to watch it. So I ended up watching it and I really liked it. But it kind of made me angry at the end. Does anybody watch that show? Probably not because it's on like AMC or something. And like, I don't know who watches AMC. I'm not sure if you do. Sorry. I just never heard of that show. But I really do like it. It was really good. I finished it in like three days because I'm a loser. Yeah. And then the other show I've been obsessed with is The Real Housewives of Orange County. Um, I used to be obsessed with it a while ago. I stopped watching it. And then I just got back in and just watched the newest season online. And I love it. There's so much drama and it's so good. And it makes me, like, not want to be a housewife, kind of, because, I don't know, their husbands, like, control them. So I was like, I don't really want to be one. Okay, and then my favorite music of this month has been the Christina Grimmie album. And I got the Christina Aguilera. Oh, well, not Christina Aguilera. I got the um, Selena Gomez album, and I kind of like it too, but I don't know. There's some songs that I'm kind of not sure if I like, like, but my favorite song on the album is Whiplash. I think that's my favorite song. Yeah. Okay, guys, so that's it for my June favorites. I hope you guys like this video, and I decided not to film in my room today because, um, I've been, my lighting has been going psychotic. I've been orange and then pale, so I did it in my dining room today. So, yeah, have a great day, everyone, and... I don't know. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Does this make you feel uncomfortable? Hi, Hi. guys. Hi. What's your issue? Does this make you feel uncomfortable? <laughs> Say hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. You know what you should do? You should take the, you know, what's the door first thing in the holiday. You've seen the, these guys. Is that recording these guys? <laughs>